Look at that black girl, look at that black girl, look at that black girl. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Shayla, but you can call me Shay. And today, I have a very special video for you guys once again. Before we get started with this video, make sure you go ahead and like this video because I know you're going to like this video. Okay, without further ado, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my winter natural hair routine for growth and moisture in these winter months. So I've already started by shampooing, conditioning, and putting a protein treatment in my hair. I'm gonna use my Grow Me Crazy hair growth butter from All Things Hair to moisturize. It's something similar to a whipped shea butter. All of the ingredients are organic and they're right on the back of the packaging and it's not even a long list. So that's how you know the ingredients are good. And I use about this much and I focus it mainly on the ends of my hair. As I always say, the ends of your hair are the oldest part of your hair. They are the elderly members of the community, so they need the most love and affection. So make sure that you are treating your ends well. Next, I'm going to detangle my hair with my Demon brush and then split the section in half so I can add on my gel. So this gel is a homemade gel that I made. It's an aloe vera plant-based gel. And then I also added some gel that I had around the house as well as some oils. So this is the consistency of it. And I'm gonna be adding that into each braid that I do from end all the way up to the root. And then once again, I'm gonna detangle before I braid up this section. And I'm gonna follow the exact same process throughout the rest of my head. Something that you wanna make sure that you're doing is spraying your hair with water so that it stays damp and that all of the products are being distributed evenly throughout the entire section and you also want to make sure that your hair is completely detangled because you don't want to experience any breakage throughout this process and also when you take out the braids you don't want to have to deal with anything being matted or all tangled up for your next wash day. So I'm doing the exact same thing throughout the rest of my head and you guys can just watch once I finish that I'll come back with the rest of what I have to say. Okay, so while I'm finishing this up, um, just to let you guys know, the purpose of this routine is to keep your hair protective, to keep your hair protected in the winter months. During the winter months, um, I try not to wear my hair out as much because the air is very dry and I don't want to experience any breakage and I also don't want my hair to be dry. I want my hair to be able to flourish and grow even in the winter, so I try to keep it up in protector styles as much as I can. Alright, so I finished half of my hair. As you can see, I don't do any braids that are like super small because I don't feel like it. And I also, um, it's a lot easier and I'm a lot more motivated to just do a few braids in my head than to do a whole bunch. So yeah, they don't have to be big. I mean, they don't have to be small and they don't have to be super neat or anything unless you plan on wearing them out, which I don't, so. So now I'm completely finished all of my braids. As you can see, my hair is looking very moisturized. The braids look nice and juicy. My ends look good. And I'm gonna finish this off just by putting on a scarf. Usually when I put these braids in, I'll wear a scarf for the week and then I'll take them out after a week or I'll refresh them after a week or something like that. If you wanna see how I tie my scarves, make sure you go ahead and check out my scarf styles video. I'll link both of those videos down below in the description box. But this is the scarf style that I decided to do today. And then I'm going to go ahead and lay my edges with that same aloe vera gel that I made and I used earlier. And that is going to be it for this week's video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope you guys are developing a routine for the winter months to keep your hair protected. And yeah, make sure you leave a like and comment and I'll see you guys in my next video.